everyone, this is Melanie Eke with richgirlnetwork.tv. Today we are at the beautiful Sunset Marquee Hotel for the gallery opening of the Winners Exhibit. This show is so amazing. It features all the winners from the Grammys and the Oscars and all the nominees. It's so exciting and I'm so excited to talk to some of the celebs in the house. Well, I mean, the gallery started in New York 14 years ago. We opened up this one four years ago and we actually just opened up our third in Maui. So we're really excited about that. But we're at the Sunset Marquee Hotel. So this is this place has music and Hollywood history all over it. It's just part of what we are about. Um, we collaborate with the hotel and do these events every month. So we do something that's a little bit bigger than just coming into the gallery and looking at pictures. We invite people, we have live music, we have hors d'oeuvres, we have um, a, a film footage, video footage that we compile and, and project over the pool. So it's kind of exciting. It's very exciting. This is definitely quite the experience. Tell us a little bit about this particular um, exhibit and the journey that we're taking through music. Well, I mean, this month is, uh, we're lucky in Hollywood that um, we have both the Grammys and the Oscars in one month here, and it all happens at this hotel. So here we are at the gallery. So we came up with an idea called Winners, which is winners of Grammys and, and Oscars, although we're considering the nominees winners too. Everybody's a winner. That's very true. So that's kind of exciting. But um, So we just put it together and curated it, and it's really a great exhibition. The other thing is that John Vervados has, has sponsored us. Vintage Trouble is performing tonight. Whoopi Goldberg, Julian Lennon are our co-hosts. We're all friends. We all hang out together. It's sort of a perfect combination. It just feels like a great connection tonight. So we're you, you clearly have the support of the Hollywood community. That's a beautiful thing. I'm sure that's very encouraging to have that backing behind Absolutely. you. Absolutely. It's great. It's really is. Let's get into some of the pieces here. We are standing behind one of your very own. We have a, a piece of Jay-Z here. Can you tell us a little bit about this piece? Well, it's funny. I shot this in 1988. Jay-Z was 18 years old. I believe he didn't even have a single out at the time. I was shooting another artist by the name of Jazzo, and, and Jay showed up at the shoot, and then I pulled him aside and did some things of him. So I just rediscovered the image. We put it on the wall on a Friday here in the gallery, and on Sunday, he bought the picture. So um, it's sort of an interesting story. But it's, um, it's kind of exciting. It's a piece of history. It was part of his history. So It definitely is. And it's exciting for me, for people who've never seen these photos. You know, some of these are never before released photos. Um, it's really kind of special. It's really kind of fun. That's amazing. What's some of your other photos in, this, in here? I've got a picture over here of um, uh, Jack Lemmon, Walter Matthau, and Neil Simon together. Um, there's a picture of Liza Minnelli of mine. Uh, there's a picture of Angelina Jolie over here. So um, a lot of both Grammy and Oscar winners. So between the Grammys and Oscars, which is your favorite award show? I like them both. <laughs> it's like children. You can't pick one. I know. You can't pick one. Is there anybody that you're exciting, just excited to see at the Grammy? Um, no, I think it's all just fun. It's just a great experience. It's great to be a part of it. Yes. Well, thank you so much for bringing this to us, and thank you so much for sharing your art with us. We really appreciate it. I appreciate it. Thank you. I'm just kidding.